weather couldn't be much better from a footballing point of view. Welcome to Selhurst Park in South London. I'm Derek Ray, and my commentary partner here on the gantry is the former Arsenal and West Ham player Stuart Robson. And we've got Premier League action coming right up. It's Crystal Palace versus Manchester United. Well, Derek, as is always the case, the team that dominates midfield would be the team that controls the flow of the game. And that, for me, is the area that's key today. Given his magnificent form, then there's every reason to believe that Cristiano Ronaldo will make an impact here. Well, he's such a natural finisher. He has everything a good goal scorer needs. Composure, technique and awareness. He will certainly need to be tightly marked today. Well, this is the team Crystal Palace have picked. Well, it'll be interesting to see how the wingers play today. Will they stay high and wide? Will they come in field and support the centre forward? And how deep will they come out of possession? They're going to be key to this formation. The lineup for Manchester United. David De Gea begins in goal. Victor Lindelof plays alongside Rafael Varane in central defence. Bruno Fernandes plays alongside Scott McTominay in midfield. And leading the line today is Cristiano Ronaldo. And the match is underway. Well, that is how to run at defenders. A really committed challenge, and it's gone out for a throw-in. And options in the centre. Gallagher. Schlup. Oh, he's gone for goal. And getting across to stop it. Played over. A truly magnificent start. An early goal in the game. Just what they were hoping to produce. Well, here you can see it again. It's a superb cross, just asking for someone to go and meet it. And then what a great finish as well. Good connection with the ball, leaving the keeper with little chance. It's a great goal. So the match has restarted, 1-0 here. Sancho. It's with Alex Tenez. Scott McTominay. Given away by Manchester United. Decent position this for United to find themselves in. Cristiano Ronaldo. Bruno Fernandes on to Ronaldo Bruno Fernandes on to Ronaldo Ronaldo and a goal here just what Manchester United required they are level Well, here it is again. The through ball is absolutely inch perfect and it's a very tidy finish because there's still a lot of work to do. That's a really good goal. Back underway. 
level begging one goal apiece in this game At times they make passing look easy. Kuyate. Are you? Klein. And it's United's turn now. Bruno Fernandes. Scott McTominay. Bruno Fernandes Fred with it Bruno Fernandes has it Sancho here's Tevez McTominay onto Ronaldo that's great goalkeeping well what a save that is he was so alert there Short corner favoured. Alex Tevez. Good effort here. And no way through. Wilfried Zaha. Jeffrey Schroep. And Palace moving the ball with purpose. But they dealt with the threat first. Well, there it is. United have had most of the ball. But in terms of creating chances, they've been well below their normal standards. Unless that changes quickly, it's going to be a really frustrating day for them. It has gone over the touchline for what will be a throw-in. Jeffrey Schrupp. And Zaha has it. Passing it around, looking for the goal that would put them ahead. Pretty comfortable piece of defending. Well, since they have the ball, quite possibly a yellow card as their flow was stopped. Well, the referee not messing about. He's cautioned him. Well, it had to be a yellow card and he knew it was coming. the crossbar the referee has indicated there will be a minimum of two minutes of having time Diogo Dallo here's Ronaldo and the managers will now deliver their half-time team talks we're at the end of 45 minutes in this game well, no doubt about it, Stuart. Cristiano Ronaldo in the first half deserving all the superlatives going. Well, they weren't at their best, but with that equaliser, you can see why he's so important to this team. Hopefully they can get more of the ball to him in the second half so he can show us his ability. And the match is underway. Oh, he's gone for goal. And getting across to stop it. Played over. A truly magnificent start. An early goal in the game. Just what they were hoping to produce. 
Bruno Fernandes. On to Ronaldo. Ronaldo! And a goal here. Just what Manchester United required. They are level. McTominay. That's great goalkeeping. Well, what a save that is. He was so alert there. since they have the ball the referee playing advantage here well the referee not messing about he's cautioned him well it had to be into the second half then and these two sides are locked together just can't really choose between them at the moment not looking confident in possession Alex Tellez has it Scott McTominay Bruno Fernandes still passing it around with authority Cristiano Ronaldo and he read it well defensively Can they hit on the break? And it looked like open road for them, but up a dead end. Bruno Fernandes. Oh, that's a super ball over the top. Alex Tellez. Using all his defensive acumen to cut it out. Schlup. Of challenge. Scott McTominay. Fred with it. Diogo Dallo. It's with McTominay. Well, they must exercise caution standing off as they are. Can he put them in front? chance but the goalkeeper comes through yes Derek we have to give credit to the keeper but surely he should have scored there that's a big big chance and United will switch things around personnel wise Who's going to get on the end of it? And he clears the danger. Bruno Fernandes has the strength to hang on to it. And now passing it through. Oh, yes! A goal! Exactly what they were looking for. And he's come up with it. Well, here's the goal again. And what a wonderfully weighted pass this is. While the movement in the box is equal to it, it's such good timing. What a goal. Here's a change for Manchester United. What a big moment in the dying embers. Will it prove decisive here? Well, they need to get tighter. Mitchell. Wilfred Zaha. Possession one. Just 15 minutes remaining. Well, let's see what they have in store for them on the break. They might be able to get in now. Excellent block. Well, clattered away. 
in a position from which they could potentially do a bit of damage here. Matic. Cristiano Ronaldo. Oh, surely! There it is! A fantastic goal, and no wonder he's off celebrating! Well, let's look at the replay. They moved the ball so well, just waiting for an opening. And from there, he never looked like missing. That's a lovely goal. And time for the change now. So the ball is moving again. We've been treated to four goals. 3-1 the score. Substitution for Crystal Palace. Anderson. Number 15, Jeffrey Shaw. Connor Gallagher. Number 10, Abreki Eze. Mitchell. Here's Anderson. Eberechi Eze on the ball. They've given it away. Matic Sancho now Fred the has indicated will be a minimum Rashford and that'll be the goalkeeper's ball and the referee blows for full time it has gone awry for Crystal Palace and their supporters no points picked up what did you make of it? Well, Derek, they weren't at their best today, both as individuals and as a team, and they didn't deserve anything from the game. Need a much better display next time out. And on the back of this, no doubt about it, Cristiano Ronaldo generating headlines. Yeah, he'll be happy coming off the pitch. He worked hard, he was always involved in the game, and he scored a very good goal. That was an impressive performance today.